Patrick and I had settled in nicely to our campsite in the Great Smoky Mountains. We had driven so far and been so many places that I got myself way behind on my correspondence. So I decided to sit down and write another letter to my ma. Dear ma, these Great Smoky Mountains have delivered on or exceeded all my expectations. They truly fill my mind with wonder and my heart with joy. Ma, I do apologize for the amount of time that has lapsed between this and my last letter to you. Patrick and I were just having so much fun exploring and visiting, I just got wrapped up. You must have been worried sick. But Ma, know that I've been doing great and we've seen so many cool things. We went to Nashville. We saw a great drag show there. But Ma, can you believe these knucklehead lawmakers down in Tennessee want to ban drag? Why can't they just let people live their lives and mind their own business? Jeez Louise. Anyway, from there, we headed to Florida to hang out with Patrick's family. Carrie, Nick, Penny, and Oliver. Well, Penny and Oliver, Ma, they're just the cutest little rascals you ever did see. I sure hope you get to meet them someday. From there, we headed up to Charleston. Ma, in Charleston, they have buildings from the 1600s. That's way older than anything we got in Seattle. Wow. But these great smoky mountains, Ma, I tell ya, the rolling hills, the misty mountains, the waterfalls, the history, it's really got it all. It truly is one of America's great national parks. Well, Ma, I've still got a lot to do here, so I do have to cut this shot. But do know that you're always in my thoughts and I will not get as far behind in my letters to you from now on. With all the love, your son, Danny.